So I usually commit to my school by bicycle. It's really easy and fast. It takes me less than 10 minutes. But lately I've been wanting to use a little bit more my Ricoh GR3. If you've been following me for a while, you know that I really love this camera. Yet I kind of struggle with the pretty wide focal length of 28 millimeters. But just like anything, if you put the effort and the practice on something you are not really good, you will eventually become better or at least less bad maybe. So what better way to incorporate some daily practice with the Ricoh GR3. That's what I did for a few days. Instead of uh, commuting by bicycle, I walked to the school and in this video you will see one commute back from school in the afternoon and the commuting to school uh, the next morning. If you want to recreate the look and the feel of my pictures, head over to my online store and consider getting my presets. They are the starting point of all my edits and are suited for most shooting situations. By buying them, you are also supporting me and the channel a whole lot so I can keep on posting and improve the production value of upcoming videos.
So as expected with some regular practice, I started to have a better hang of what the Ricoh GR3 can do and cannot do. I have been experimenting with different settings and shooting mode and yeah, um, recently the hype around the Fujifilm X100V has been quite extreme. I think the Ricoh should also get their lot of attention as they can compete in terms of uh, image quality and they are true pocketable cameras which make the shooting experience very casual and really fun I think. Yet it is not as good of a fashion accessory as the Fuji X100 line, but when it comes to taking picture, it's a killer everyday camera. I updated my GR to the latest firmware, which introduced more customization on the snap focus and more importantly, a snap distance priority mode. I feel that this can be extremely efficient in the streets to be more quick to react and use it almost as a true point and shoot camera. A lot more to explore and try on that side, which is very exciting and you can expect a video about this coming soon.
all in all, I really love this experience of uh, introducing some photography practice in my daily commute. If you have the possibility to do so, I would highly recommend it. If you stick to it over a long period of time, you will make some tremendous progress. I'm really confident about this. It gives you the opportunity to witness some very special scenes, especially in the morning, I think. Last but very not least, a ball of fresh air and turning those legs for daily walks feels very good. And yeah, I know this sounded really much like a very average doctor advice, but yeah, looking forward for your feedback and let's catch up in the next one. Bye.